give you examples of three plants that have spiny fruits jackfruit pineapple litchi datura spiny stem cactus silk floss tree silk cotton tree red flowers rose dahlia hibiscus tulips yellow flowers marigold daffodil sunflower leaves which close at night amla gulmohar rain tree single seeded fruits mango berries cashew many seeded fruits custard apple papaya watermelon observe any one flower and its various parts and describe it in your own words observe this flower you have to describe it in your own words of these parts of flowers a flower has following parts flowers may have a long or a short stalk called pedicle one end of the pedicle is attached to the stem the other end of the pedicle is expanded and swollen it is called the receptacle petals and other parts of the flower are supported on the receptacle calyx corolla androecium gynoecium are different parts of a flower calyx in the bud condition the petals are covered by leaf like parts called sepals which are green in color they form the calyx corolla this is made up of colorful parts called petals observe the shape color and smell of the corolla of various plants like the rose chrysanthemum hibiscus mogra kanner tiger etc androecium this is the male reproductive part of the flower it consists of stamens each stamen is made up of anther and filament gynoecium this is the female reproductive part of the flower this is made up of carpels a carpel consists of stigma style and ovary what are the similarities and differences between jowar and moong jowar has fibrous root moong has tap root jowar is a monocotyledonous plant moong is a dicotyledonous plant jowar is a rabbi crop moong is a karif crop jowar grain is full of carbohydrates moong seed is full of proteins onion and coriander onion is a biennial plant coriander is an annual plant onion is a monocotyledonous plant coriander is a dicotyledonous plant onion has fibrous root coriander has tap root but later on changes to fibrous root system onion is grown from seed or its bulb coriander is grown from its seeds leaves of banana and mango banana leaf as parallel venation mango leaf as reticulate venation leaves of banana is a monocotyledonous plant leaves of mango is a dicotyledonous plant leaves of banana is very large in size leaves of mango is small in size coconut tree and jowar stock plant coconut tree is strong and very tall jowar stock plant is dwarf and weak coconut tree is a perennial plant jowar plant dies soon after the cob is born coconut tree has strong root system jowar stock plant has weak root system explain the following images in your own words observe these images and write it in your own words the diagram a is of maize seed it is a monocotyledonous seed and does not divide into two equal parts 
the plant has fibrous root system diagram b is of bean seed it is a dicotyledonous seed and it divides into two equal parts the plant has tap root system describe the functions of various parts of a plant root fixation it anchors the plant body to the soil so helps in fixation absorption it absorbs water and nutrients from the soil so helps in absorption conduction the root translocates water and mineral salts into the stem storage a certain amount of food is stored in the root which is utilized as it grows preventing soil erosion it helps to bind the soil particles and prevent them from being blown away by wind or water stem it supports and holds leaves flower and fruits the stem conducts the water and minerals from roots to leaves and fruits it stores the food leaves it synthesizes food for the plant stomata the tiny openings in the leaf help in gaseous exchange and are responsible for the process of transpiration flower it helps in pollination fruit it protects the seed it helps in seed dispersal seed a new plant develops from it certain properties are mentioned below find the leaf corresponding to each property and describe those plants leaves with smooth surface leaves with rough surface fleshy leaf spines on leaf leaves with smooth surface example banana leaf it is large in size it is closely rolled up one over the other together they look like a trunk but they form only an apparent trunk it has parallel venation leaves with rough surface example hibiscus leaf it has reticulate venation leaf margin is toothed fleshy leaf example jade plant potter hyacinth it has fleshy glossy and smooth leaves they are colored jade green and having a slightly red tinge towards the edge of leaves when exposed to higher level of light spines on leaf example opuntia sea cass kevda opuntia is a desert plant leaf is thick fleshy and having spines on it find the plant parts this question is puzzle type you have to search the words of the parts of a plant in puzzle box answers are given directly root cap ovum petals bud root hair calyx node vein leaf stem radical flower etc use your brain power what would have happened if plants like tamarind banyan and mango had fibrous roots if plants like banyan mango tamarind had fibrous roots they would get uprooted and fall even with a little strong wind as the roots would not be able to support and anchor the trees firmly what will happen if the root tip is injured root cap helps the root to grow downward it protects the sensitive part of the root and eases the movement of the root through the soil injury of the root tip causes the root to grow randomly and it also may lead to injury of the sensitive part of the root which types of roots do the fenugreek spinach and onion plants have fenugreek and spinach have tap roots with a few secondary roots whereas onion has fibrous root fenugreek roots also have some nodules which contain nitrogen fixing bacteria of what use to a plant are the insects flitting about around its flowers insect help in pollination of the flowers they transfer the pollen grains from one flower to another